Hey man, if you're an introvert and you're shy, you're unconfident, welcome to this video. I'm glad you're watching this. Listen here, if you're someone who lacks a lot of social skills, you don't know how to communicate, I'm super grateful that you're on this video. I was once in the same position as you. I'm terrible. I was terrible at speaking. I was terrible at communicating. I was terrible at articulating my ideas and being in social settings because I was very shy, unconfident. Now I just put myself out there, have fun. I love experiencing new conversations, and you should be able to come at to come to that point where you can experience beautiful conversations, meet new people, and have an experience beauty the beauty of life essentially and i'm grateful that you're here on this video because i want to really talk about that whoever you are this is who you are remember that you should be proud of where you're at right now if you don't know how to communicate this is the first step you have that awareness and i'm grateful that you're on this video because you're aware that you need to improve your communication skills that's the first step having awareness a lot of people are stuck they feel like they don't know what to do but they're very, very naive and they're very like adamant, stubborn, thinking that they don't have to change. But the reality is you got to change. If you want to become a better communicator, you have to put yourself in new positions. You have to get out of your comfort zone. You have to put yourself in uncomfortable positions to thrive, to grow, to get rid of that old version of yourself and to reinvent your new version of yourself to become the man you desire, the person you desire, right? And right now, I just want to touch upon being authentic. Who are you? What do you do on a daily basis? Who do you want to become? Are you the man you want to become? Are you the man who is already taking the steps to achieving that desired reality you want? For example, if you know that you want to hit the gym, are you hitting the gym? Are you building a muscle? If you know that you want to become a better communicator, what are you doing on a current current basis, current daily basis, right? That is important. Having the awareness, being able to tell yourself that, hey, it's time to change. It's time to make new progress. It's time to take away a few habits that aren't serving me, right? And I truly believe a lot of you guys need to take responsibility and understand exactly what's right and what's wrong, what's working, what's not working. Be your authentic self. And it's okay. If you truly love like playing video games or watching movies, watching TV shows, you gotta understand you can't be doing that on a daily basis for like four or six hours, four to six hours, because that's not gonna move the needle in your life. If you lack a lot of social skills, if you don't know how to communicate, spend at least five hours. Let's just say you watch movies on a daily basis for six hours. Hey man, watch a movie. Let's like slow it down. Let's try to bring the time down when you when it comes to watching movies because it's great to watch movies. There's a lot of benefits to it. But the reality is if you want to become a better communicator, if you want to change your lifestyle, you have to start taking new actions. The new actions is ultimately going to lead you to having a better life. You have to change something. So let's just say you love watching movies. You want to become a better communicator. All right. Let's just say you watch three movies on a daily basis. All right, let's cut it down to one. So you have an extra three to four hours in your day. Start by reading how to win a friends, uh, how to win friends and influence people. Start by going outside, talking to strangers. Start by recording videos. Start by talking to your phone, doing voice memos. This is ultimately going to help you to become a better communicator, right? There are simple steps. Remember. You are going to be overwhelmed, but you got to have a strategy. You got to have a plan on exactly what you want to do. And if you're new to this, you don't have a plan or a goal or anything like that. And you're completely like, dang, this is hard. This is difficult. I don't know what to do. Well, okay. Let's just say you totally suck at articulating your ideas and you don't know how to communicate. My challenge to you is to start talking to your phone in the voice memo app and talking as much as you can until a point you do not have anything to say every single day, at least once a day, all right? So this ultimately helps you to build up your endurance when it comes to speaking. Basically, what I mean by that is that you can bounce to new ideas, topics, even if it doesn't make sense, 
that's ultimately going to help you to become more confident when you are speaking because the more experience you have when it comes to speaking you're going to become competent which is going to help you to become competent in social settings it's completely different when it comes to social settings but that's the first step you have the awareness the second step is putting it into action becoming a better communicator by practicing and then out there the third step is to go outside and to truly start talking to strangers and having fun with it it's simple right it's simple it's not easy but that's a small game plan you can use put this into action the first 30 days you can literally transform your communication skills i know you can i've been i've been literally been recording myself every single day in the voice memo apps for a good amount of days now and i can just ultimately tell that i'm becoming a better communicator i have more things to say and i want you guys to realize you can do the exact same thing I'm doing. So take action and create the reality you want to create. Just remember to take it easy and everything will be fine.